guys welcome back to my channel thank you all so much for tuning in um today's video is going to be a video request that i got and it's to do my eyebrow routine and i debated about whether i wanted to do this video or not just because i have really really thick eyebrows and most people who have issues with i guess making their eyebrows look a certain type of way have tend to have like thinner eyebrows and i really didn't want to do a video that i thought wouldn't help so I really don't know if this video is going to be helpful or helpful or not um, as you can see I have nothing on them nothing's done to them they're just um, I just took a razor you know I just razor them just to keep them shaped up um, I just I've always had an issue just taming them so I just do stuff to maintain them so this video isn't gonna be very long just because I really don't do a lot to them um, but the products that I will be using I'm gonna go ahead and show you is the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, brow pencil and it has a pencil on the end and a spoolie on the other end I will also be using um, the MAC mineralized concealer and it's in NW40 and this is that and I will be using my Anastasia Beverly Hills brow gel and lastly um, I'll be using an angled brush and you can use any angled brush I use um, the one I have right now is the elf angled brush I think this was like three dollars at the store so this is a very very cheap very very inexpensive um, but those are the four products I'm gonna use to do my brow routine so if you want to see what I do to get achieve how my brows look then please continue to watch okay so I've decided to talk through this video instead of doing a voiceover um, just because I feel like it'll be easier to tell you everything I'm doing as I go along um, but here I'm going to start off with the spoolie on the end I'm just going to start out by brushing them out with the spoolie um, as you can see they're super thick I really I mean it's a blessing and a curse you know I don't have to get up in the morning and do anything to them every day but you know at the same time they get a little wild and crazy like this is them tame so just imagine them like not arched or anything but yeah I just start off by brushing them out and once I do that I'm gonna take the other end and I'm just gonna you're just gonna sculpt it out like the arch that you want out my brows have like a natural arch to them on both sides so I just kind of follow that natural line and go along with that and I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side just just follow that natural line and just sculpt it out and you just fill in the middle wherever you think you know that you might have some empty spots you just fill that in So next I'm going to take my mineralized concealer and I'm just going to, going to use my angled brush to get a little bit off on the end of it and I'm going to um, take it and sculpt out the rest of my brows where the arch is and I'm going to do that at the top and the bottom. And this just really gives your brows some definition. I think this is really what makes my brows look a lot better. Um, because without this step included, like my brows can look really, really crazy. So this just really cleans it up a lot and gives you a natural um, arch if you're lacking one. And if you have like, let's say you haven't gotten them waxed or whatever you choose to do, let's say you haven't gotten that done this really you know helps to kind of take the focus so much off of that and just kind of give it some definition and next I'm just gonna blend that in All right, 
right, and to seal them off, I take my Anastasia Beverly Hills Clear Brow Gel, and I just apply that all up over them. And I try not to, you know, get too crazy with the brushing because it will, like, brush it out of place. So I just brush that to kind of get them into, to hold for the rest of the day. And this keeps them from moving or you know, getting crazy throughout the day. All right, guys, so that is how I achieve my eyebrow look. Um, as you can see, very short, very simple, um, nothing too dramatic or anything. Um, I really don't consider myself perfected in the eyebrow area, so I can just tell you what I do to tame mine down. Um, but one tip that I can give you that um, a cousin of mine, shout out to Maria if you're watching, um, and she made this statement and I really thought about it and I said, oh my goodness, that makes so much sense. But you have to look at your eyebrows as sisters, not twins. They're never going to be identical. They're never going to look exactly alike. That's just the reality of it. I mean, they're not going, going to be, especially if you don't get them, even if you get them waxed, they aren't going to be exactly alike. So all you have to, you, what you have to do is try to maintain them and get them as close as possible to each other. They're going to have similarities, but they're not going to be exactly alike. So just look at them as their sisters, not twins, and try to really focus on getting them as similar as possible and working with what you have. Um, me personally, I have super thick eyebrows and you know, some people, I get it all the time, oh my goodness, I wish I had your eyebrows and I'm like, girl, no you don't, but they, they're a lot harder to manage than people realize and I've always had an issue since I was younger, you know, with maintaining them just because I don't get them waxed or anything. I just have learned to arch them myself and yeah, they just, you know, this is how I get this look and I hope I can help, help someone out there um, with this tutorial. Um, and you know, if you have any more video requests, please comment them down below and don't forget to hit that red subscribe button if you haven't already. And thank you all so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye.